up. What is that smell? Why is there so much smoke here? Angela, what are you doing here? Blast okay. I have become one with the Beyblade. I am ready to battle you. What are you doing here? I have discovered the secret of the Beyblade. Are you ready for a battle? Guys, welcome back to the Blast Zone. Today is my first Beyblade Micros vid. I'm gonna be talking about how Beyblade Micros work and where you could get them for cheap and whether or not you should buy them or not. I got a lot of Beyblade Micros, as you can see, in random boosters. And I also got this Beyblade Micros, Valtriac, and uh, Spryzen. Don't forget to enter to win our awesome giveaway, Brigham Requiem. We've been away two this month, so that doubles your chances to win. So be sure to enter our awesome giveaway. Now, let's get on to this awesome video, how Beyblade Micros work. It's pretty much the same concept, but it's very hard for them to burst unless it's like a huge power hit. There's only two parts for Beyblade Micros, the energy layer and the driver. You put it together the same way when you're gonna get ready to rip, it's very different. You see this big white thing? To match it with that and then you rip it. Here's my complete Beyblade Micros collection. Valtria, Gainon, Zutron, Roctavore, Exceedivalize, Ryzen, Odax, Minoboros, Doomsizer, Kabeus, Wyvron, Forsu. As you can see, I ended up buying a lot of doubles because I bought them in random boosters. When you buy random boosters, you can end up buying a lot of doubles. Comparison of the size, as you can see, this one's huge and this one's small. The drivers are different. This one kind of looks like Jaggy, but this is boost variable. Regular Beyblades, better stickers, and a better design than the Beyblade Micros. Here is the launcher for the Beyblade Micros. I don't like it that much because it's a small grip and you could like slip your hand very easily when you rip. You could pair them up, but only two at a time when you pair. You really want your rip cord to be straight so it's not curved and it gives you a bad launch. Now I'm gonna do a couple of battles and see how fun they are. The first battle, Mini Zutron versus Mini Valtria. Come on, Ri Come on Valtria. Ring out for Zutron. I think there's only ring outs and spin finishes. There can be a burst if it's a really hard hit. Come on Valtria, let's do this. Ooh. Oh! Zutron came out of the hole. The next battle, Gyanon and the Legendary Bay. Come on, rip. rip, rip, Come on, Legendary Bay, you got this. Oh, great attack. Gynon wins this battle. Come on, let him rip. You don't rip. Come on, Legendary, Gynon. Oh, you hit. Come on, Gynon wins. Yes, those were awesome battles. Now I'm gonna talk the advantages and the disadvantages of buying Beyblade Micros. The advantages. First, there's a lot of ring outs when you play. Literally, when they play, they can like fly out of the stadium. And the second reason, you could get them for really cheap, especially at Walgreens. They're like $2 at Walgreens. Some video of me getting some at Walgreens last week. Another advantage is that the action is very fast. When they hit, it's a very cool and has a lot of action. Disadvantages of buying Beyblade Micros. First, they don't burst that much. It's very rare if they burst in battle. Second disadvantage is you could end up buying a lot of duplicates when you buy uh, your Beyblade Micros. That's why you should buy them at Walgreens because they're like $2. I would suggest not to buy them online because they're like $10 a piece and it's not worth it. Bye guys. Have oh, What is that smell? Why is there so much smoke here? Angela, what are you doing here? Blast zone kit. I have become one with the Beyblade. I am ready to battle you. This is crazy! What are you doing here? I have discovered the secret of the Beyblade, and I will use it to defeat you. Are you ready for a battle? I accept your challenge. I have many kung fu moves for my own. 